Here's another great channel bringing us another live stream today. One of our members following the Yellow Brick Road. Now this is a channel you should really check out. Always full of great info and places. Go check her out. Hey everybody. Roy forgot his coffee. Jasper. So hold on a minute here. Jasper Lee. Enough. I forgot what I was doing, everybody. I hit the Jasper. wrong button there. Oh. Alrighty. Alrighty. Yeah, Roy forgot his coffee. It's in the rig. Mel, Nettie, living free zip colors. Rose is getting ready to leave us here. I'll stand up real quick. Safe <laughs> travel. Jasper, people are about to hug mommy. That's Rose, Ray, Rose is waving by. <laughs> See y'all later, dude. She it's can. It's Mom it's can it's get. It's he won't let people hug me. All right. Eat your nose, buddy. Eat your nose. Yep. Mel Nettie Living Free Sip Cola is first one up here. First member in here. Howdy. We got Lee. Morning, Lee. I leave in a big mess over there. That's fine. Desert Adventures in Arizona. Another member. Howdy, howdy. Traveling on Adventures, another member. Uh, Terry and Earl's getting ready to hit the road, too, aren't you? Uh, let's see. Catherine Cook and Homer, another member. Ava Potter, Field and Friends, howdy. Let's see, I'm making sure I'm trying not to miss anybody. Hey, Going Green Mom. Got Rosie getting ready to hit the road. So, but yeah. Yesterday, we like to walk and eat. That's the one where uh, Roy went to take Jasper for a walk. And um, I didn't think about the, the lake there. And I thought, yep, Roy's going for a swim. Because Jasper is a water lover. Uh-uh, Jasper. Jasper. No one zipping the clam. So... But, yep, it's Monday, people. It's a Monday. So, how was everybody's weekends? Uh, we didn't do a whole lot. I ain't gonna lie. Let's see. I'm trying to get the weather up. All right, the weather. Here we go. I'm not awake yet. Coffee ain't kicked in. I ain't gonna lie. Says it's 60 right now with a high of 74. The low tonight's 48. Humidity is 40% right now. And it says air, good air quality. Okay. Says it feels like 64. Go figure. So, but yeah. But yeah. It's a Monday. I'm not fully functioning yet. Uh. Jasper is starting to improve. Knock on some wood. If everybody can still keep him in their prayers. Because uh, Big Boy hasn't hardly been eating for us. But he got up this morning. He ate his milk bone. He ate his hip treatment. joint or Hip and joint treats. He ate those. And he did nibble on some dry kibble. I have tried the wet kibble with him. I've tried... Making his rice like he likes. What else did I try? He just was not eating like he normally would. But today he's up. He's been running around like a lunatic. So. So maybe it was just a. Um, a bug. Stomach bug. But he's. Hopefully he's on the mend. Hey Miss Julia. Morning. So yeah. And let's see. Trying to think. We had some hellacious winds through here. Hey, Hawkins Family Adventures. 
Um, I made brownies in the Coleman oven like yesterday, and like they never got it done because of the wind. So, and then we did, I don't know if you want to call it rain or drops. I think we got a few drops. Yeah, it, it's, I actually uh, ran around in shorts, but it was kind of nippy towards the end yesterday out here. But, um, so, my big Coleman oven is the type that you put on top the Coleman, uh, cook stove. It's not very big, but I can get a, what is it, an 8x8, eight eight, uh, baking pan in there, like a cake pan. I can fit that in there. Um, I can fit the small muffin pans I got. We wanted that because it folds down. And we could store it. Um, if it wouldn't have been for our gun commander and the reenactment, we couldn't find one. And he says, hold on, I got one down in my basement sitting there doing nothing because they don't, they didn't camp anymore. And those aren't period correct when you do Civil War reenactments. So he gave it to us. And it packs down and it fits in its own little carrying box that the guy made. But, I mean, I could do a small thing of muffins. I can, like the brownies, put them in that little 8x8 eight eight bacon pan. And I could do pie pans in there. So, it's just big enough for us. And at least then I don't got to heat the whole rig up. Bacon. <laughs> you met up with Greg and Shelly yesterday. Hi, Greg and Shelly. Tell them hi from Roy and Becky. But, um. Yep, so, let's see, I made cookies in it, yeah, I usually cannot get brownies to, I either, I either overcook them, and when I get done, they're hard, or, or they're gooey, 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 you know, like, ugh, 39 and snowflake, yuck. So, I mean, that's all cool with that. So, have we will. Just regular brownies, Lee. Nothing special. I'm not that kind of baker. But, um. So, yeah. He had he ran out of sweets. So, the big baby had to have his, uh. Sweets. And, let's see. I think I got one more brownie mix to make. But, I'm not making a bunch. So, yep. But, yeah, when you said you were going to Wakani, and I'm like, oh, yeah, we enjoyed it. We stayed there three nights, I think. And Roy went to walk Jasper first, because, you know, we got three. And I was getting dinner ready. So he said, while you're doing dinner, I'll take the dogs, you know, for a quick walk to wear them out. But he said, I'm only doing one at a time. And I'm like, okay, no biggie, you know. Yeah. So, he he takes Jasper first. And he goes, I'm going to go up by the lake. And I'm like, okay. And then I thought, you know, I'm finishing up the dinner and all that. And I'm like, lake and Jasper. Oh, crap. And I grab Lou and Moose, you know, I'm walking them, because dinner's done, you know, get them there and get them back. And I thought for sure Roy was going to be uh, swimming in the lake, but because of the big fish in there, Jasper wouldn't even put his big foot in it. So, yeah. Yeah, I got to watch, I got, I tried to watch it, but I got parts of it in there. It's up, it's up. Because when we were there, I mean, well, it was kind of dry, too, that year, so. But Moose kept sticking his big head in my way, because, you know, God forbid you have the phone and not loving on him. So, but, yeah, it looked up. Oh, I'm jealous. These are, uh, oh, my gosh, help me out, Mel and Nettie. Are they the garfish that are in Lake Tawakani? They're huge. They got teeth. 
And yeah, he was like, nope, I ain't going in that water. So, but yeah, I know. But yeah, they were, they were like flopping all over. And Jasper was like, nope, I'm not getting in the water with something that splashes like that. And Moose, Moose made sure he stayed it. Because, you know, Moose is a big chicken. He wouldn't even go near the edge of the water. So, yeah. Lou was like, okay, cool. Be safe, Steve. So. Well, I don't know what these were, but they got big teeth and they are the ugliest dang fish I've ever seen. And I'm like, mmm. Yeah, the blue bonnets. Yeah. So, but yeah, they were some big ugly fish in there. And that's where we went to the, um, that retired Air Force base with Mel Nettie Linfrey Zip Close, uh, living Zip Close, I cannot talk, and Greg and Shelly. And then, uh, the day they went to the, um, Gene Autry Museum, Roy wasn't feeling good, so we went the following day. So, yeah. But, yeah, it's... It's getting crunch time. We're already plotting our uh, solar plan panels up above. Because, you know, that way we ain't got to lift all of them. But, yeah. Jan or John can tell us, yeah. Um. Hey, what, no, that's the Chinese. What's the Chinese one going up down the river that they don't want to get in Lake Michigan? Carp? Some kind of carp? Anywho, I don't remember. <laughs> I know that one's an ugly looking thing. It killed a lady. It, they jump out of the water and it um, smacked her upside the head and killed her. Hey, Naj, never late, never late. As you can see, Roy's late. Never, nothing new. Yeah, it's a Chinese carp, ain't it? But yeah, them fish are bad news too. No, but whatever was in Lake Tawakani, it looked like it had teeth. And they were ugly. Let me see. Fish in Lake... It probably won't let me search. Jasper, no. You're not bumming. Uh-huh. Must have read my mind. I oh, know that ain't it. It wasn't no white bass. wasn't no striped bass. Uh-uh. That ain't none of them. No channel catfish. This thing was huge. Large mouth bass and bluegill. No. That ain't what we saw. Ain't no carpy either, trust me. So, Roy could probably tell you. I want to say he called him a gar. Some kind of gar. Two potlucks and made a coconut cake and a pineapple cake. Yum. I am craving a German chocolate cake. Sadly, they do not make it in... Uh, or that I've seen it sugar free. So, yeah. Yeah, these had teeth. And I mean, they were just flopping all over in the water out there. It's like, ooh. There's a Chinese weather balloon. Yeah, this is some kind of invasive carp that's going up the Mississippi. And Chicago, um, they're trying to get Chicago to shut something. And they're refusing to. To me, it sounds like to me if if it, if if it's that bad of a fish that it eats all the other living fish, to me it looks like they could find Chicago for not closing it if it gets into that lake, because it'd kill everything. Oh my goodness! Yeah, you have to tell us about that, cause I am craving a German chocolate cake. 
And I have not found sugar free yet. I'll have to do some more snooping. Are you sunning yourself down there, dude? So, but yep. Yeah. yeah, I'm. I'm now, my his niece used to be able to make it from scratch, but you still got to have the sweet part in it. And I've discovered, even with my some of my the sugar I use, the stevia on that, I tried to make no bake cookies, and they just did not form right. So certain things just got to have, you know, the sugar. <laughs> There, there's no way around it, so, but yeah, they were more like, um, a goo cluster, I guess. They just did not form. And then I made them with the regular sugar, and they turned out fine, so. I have to find a different one besides Stevia to see if I can bake with it, because... We got try we got people moving around all over today. Goodness. But yeah, it was a little dis I was a little sad because the no bakes didn't turn out right. But then it used regular sugar, did the same thing in those forms, so it had to be the stevia didn't form. I don't know if I needed less of it or maybe a little more, but it was just a they were just big old blobs of you had to take a spoon and eat them. So, yeah. <laughs> Trying to think if we got plans today. Not that I know of. Roy's got to go get water. I do know that. It was too windy yesterday. And he just didn't feel like it. Roy don't use sweetener. He can use regular sugar. That's the problem. I can't. <laughs> When I use mine, which is the stevia, it just turned into, like I said, instead of uh, no bakes, it was a little blob. And it never hardened, or we caught form right. But then I turned around and I made some with the regular sugar. I know it ain't good for you, but they formed. So it's something with stevia. There was something else I tried to make with stevia and it just didn't turn out right either. So, I might have to try another one. So, I don't know. Maple syrup? Uh, because uh, they use sugar to make it. I don't know. I'm going to have to experiment some with it to get it to turn out right. But, yeah, the ones with the stevia, mm-mm. Hey, traveling Martin and Sue. Oh, laundry mat. Nice. Roy is getting his hugs. Rose is getting ready to pull out. So, she's getting ready to start heading her way back slowly east. So, but yeah, I don't know, my, my baking with the sugar that I can use versus the regular sugar, right now it's like two, zero to two, that just ain't turning out, so, proud of her, yep, here he comes, yeah, Rose is very sweet. Hey, what? she's leaving courtside with her tail wagging. Yep. A lot of them leave with their tails tucked. Yep, not coming back. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Your dog was wanting to come with you. I bet. There he is. <laughs> what kind of fish was that in Lake Tawakini that spooked Jasper? Was it a gar? Gar. See, yeah. But when you go to list, when you go to look on Google... They don't even mention that fish. Mm. Jasper was scared of him. Yeah, Miss Rose, she's a very nice lady. And a new friend. Yes, she is. Yep. I think she's heading down to Yuma first. Go say goodbye to Ivan. And then uh, head back up here. Yeah. 
and then over. Well, not here, but had she. Well, unless she, she goes eight. eight. Yeah, she can she take eight. eight over. I keep forgetting about Interstate Eight. Yeah. We ain't been on it too much, except in Yuma and maybe around Tucson or Phoenix. I don't remember. Where I don't remember. Now. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Yep, that time of year. Yeah, I hate this time of year. I really do. This is the worst time. This is the, the worst time of the year, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Jasper is mad because Rose gave me a hug. Well, have you talked to Kat this morning? Not yet. Oh, because she's wanting to go over and tell goodbye, say goodbye and give her a hug. She may or may not be up. I, don't, she has, I haven't talked to her. My water is frozen. Or frozen. I can oh. message her, though. Yeah, message her. Me Maybe try the coconut palm sugar for your baking. Yeah, remember when I tried to make the no bake cookies with my sugar and they didn't turn out, but mm. your sugar did. The regular sugar. I made two batches. Ah. <laughs> Frozen. Frozen. Won't be long. Let's see if cats. Ah. Oops, I can't even type. I can't talk and I can't type. I love ice water. It's one of my favorite drinks, actually. So far, my allergies are feeling better today, but I screwed up last night after I left your place. I uh, took a Zyrtec, thinking that I hadn't took one, and I had taken one earlier. So I screwed up and doubled up the allergy <laughs> med last night, and <laughs> I was not wor <laughs> I was not with it last night after it kicked in. <laughs> I got all. I didn't get on. I went into Ron's live on the chat, and I think I might have said a whole three uh, comments, and I had to go. <laughs> well, he was he shut it down. He was and getting shut down. Anyway. Dude, he'd been on about an hour. Coconut palm sugar. I never heard of that. No. Huh. All I know is stevia does not bake does not do no bake cookies well. And there was something else I tried to make with, it and it didn't turn out that great either. I need a system to keep from doing that. Well, she has included it in my morning meds now for right now. Cause but I, I told him yesterday when I gave it to him, I said, there's Zyrtec in there. Okay. I don't remember. That's the problem. Okay. <laughs> and everybody's doing it's about six. What? We just ate? And he's sitting there going. Oh, now, right. Benadryl has a worse effect on <laughs> I can hey, sleep. Back. I can sleep standing up on Benadryl, because <laughs> I, I don't take allergy meds enough to have it in my system where I'm used to it. And when I take them, oh man, they kick they kick my butt. <laughs> we had to put the bed down so the big kid could lay down. But yeah, it's a crappy kind of day, ain't it? Yep. I think we're gonna have to know too. Yeah. Hey, Diane Phoenix. Howdy, Diane. Oh, I set his meds up, but he. Normally, his allergies are fine. Yeah, I have fall allergies in, in Indiana, and it's ragweed. And there you go. There's no ragweed in this part of the state. That we know of. The only ragweed is in the south eastern, uh, southeastern side of Arizona. Yep, she's up. And she can't. Yep. So Rose is on her way to give her a hug and a goodbye. Have you all added vitamin C? I can't do vitamin C. It gives me it's vitamin heartburn. C. Gives me heartburn. Even the gummies. Yep, yep. So now we got Gracie here, traveling Martin and Sue, CR View, us, Greg, Alma, and Buckeye Kitty are the only ones left. So we got one, two, three, four. Find me the game five, of Survivor. Who outlast? Rose has been voted off the island. <laughs> no, seriously, she's got to leave. We didn't vote nobody off the island. <laughs> she's got some stuff to take care of in Missouri. She's wanting to get her storage set. One of these times, we're going to do that when we have our group camp like this. We're going to have everybody, and then at the end of the, you know how Survivor does it at the end of the season, the two remaining survivors or three, yeah. hey, they're, they're, they burn Odyssey. their, uh, what are those things called? Their, 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 their torches. Their torches. They throw them all in a pile with their names on it, and they burn them all. We're going to do that one of these times. Get some local honey. Helps not. Yes, yes, and the local honey here I love. Oh, it tastes so good. When does that guy leave? <laughs> He's here all year. Okay. So. Uh, Ken stays open all year, too. Okay, I know that. 
Yeah. Yeah, but to, it's from all the green. Have a fire and spend some time with Rose last night, but man, that window was yeah, it was. Um, we're probably gonna have a fire tonight. Uh, yeah, we're getting Gracie's quite... really liking to have a fire. And we gotta get. And I told Rose to come back if she's still in, so we'll see. Yeah, we gotta burn some cardboard. Yep. Hey, Timmy Red King, and Melnetti's back. CRB just popped in. Yep, Another CRB. <laughs> uh, highly recommend rose hips for vitamin C. Most vitamin C is made from mold grown citrus peels. That's the citrus acid that gets me from the yeah, vitamin C. I can't do it. Shoot, heartburn city. I even tried the gummies. Rose I ended up giving hips. them. What are rose hips? That's another Ooh. herb. What? Mm. What? Nothing, nothing. What's a rose hip? It's a. I don't know. I'm not no herbatologist. Oh, oh, we got it. Oh, no, no, yeah. I thought it was 30 minutes. A rose hip. It's a flower. It's a rose Par hip? No, look it up. You got the world hip in... to be square? We'll pick up some more. Yeah, they're doing uh, laundry. Now. Oh, well, thank you. Well, yeah. Pretty... I don't, know I don't really know how much is out there. I know there's a box and a bag. and. Yeah, we got to get this game put up, too. Yep, yep. We'll put it in storage. Everybody's telling Rose safe travels. Rose hips are part of the rose that develops under the flower to hold the seeds. Oh. Oh, okay. Skyla's not happy. <laughs> oh, that is Skyla, yeah. Because Rose is out giving hugs. I gotta, I gotta say this about her van. That is one of the best sounding Vortex engines i've ever heard that engine is strong in that I mean, no rattles no clanks no nothing no squeaks nothing yeah. it is that's a stout engine rest of the van needs a little work well mainly her air conditioning needs worked on now but yeah she needs to take that in so somebody but, knows what they're looking at and the electrical it has some electrical issues but man that has got one good sounding Ooh, engine have fun it. steve going well, inside loads of by hey lance project. they got boondocking i wish there was a menards out here Boondocking with Boomer. Hey, Lance. What's up, Lance? Heard y'all want to get some rain in Indiana. Well, not us. We're not <laughs> in Indiana. No, we ain't getting no rain. They might, but we're not. <laughs> um, we did get a little bit of rain here last night. Just enough. As soon as it got the porch wet, it, it was gone. <laughs> yeah. as, as I said, a few drops. I was baking brownies out here in the oven. And, See? Uh, what we barely got it done barely got it done we were going to bake the meatballs in the oven but i think we're running out of propane just as the brownies got done maynard's that's our favorite place oh, to go. Love menards oh love menards yeah. there's none out here it's you know and they're they they sponsor nascar and nascar trucks and nascar and cars and you would think they they would be around the country by now be but nope, not yet. It's supposed to rain there tonight, going green, Mom says. Martin here, and I cannot type that fast enough to keep up with everybody. Mel and Danny are looking forward to our Friday Night Live appearance. Yes. This weekend, I got the link to send you guys to. Um, this the Friday night, 7 o'clock Central, our special guest this week will be traveling to Martin and Sue. Um, we cannot wait for that. Because... They are a great couple and going to be fun. And yep. Just can't wait for Friday night. We get our fair share of rain early this morning and then some. Uh, nope, nope, nope. No rain here. Diane says tomorrow where she's at in southern Indiana. Yes, we have the live stream up. So, and but yeah. I think we're, are we linked? Did you link up? I don't know. Nope, I don't think we are. We You're have fired. to be right after Nettie, whip on him. Oh, 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 why am I yawning? I got a good night's sleep, sort of. So we'll have Mel Nettie living free zip code list, traveling on adventures, Ford Man, aka Kenneth Oaks, us, and Merton. traveling Merton and Sue yep. on Friday night. Uh, okay, they still need to link up. Nope. Okay. Yep. What? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, because I didn't link. Yeah. As soon as this live stream's done, we will. And we yeah. have to pay, play the connection is understood. Because I went over that there. Oh. All right. And we about we'll be right back right after we say thank you to our members. 
prepare for this? So the plan today, what are we doing? You gotta get water and take the trash out. I gotta get water and take the trash out. Yep. I do, don't I? Yep. Yes. Um what else? What's for dinner? I don't know yet. Because we didn't pull anything out. No. We had spaghetti last night. Well, yeah, we have man, we love spaghetti. <laughs> and that sauce that you're using, that great value sauce in the jar. No, oh my no god. No high corn fruit. That is some good sauce for store bought sauce. I tell you what, some of that great value stuff, I think, is better. Well, it's made by Con most of it's made by Congo Foods. Yeah. Congo Foods or whatever. Yeah. There is a fly in here, just so you know, and he's biting. He is. Well, we'll just have to break out the bug assault gun. Why does it look so rough up there? What? The it looks flap. Like a mountain range. The flap is up. Well, I hope the flap ain't. Look at it. I oh, know I ain't walked around to that side. That's kind of bugging me. What are you doing? You ain't gonna get to see that because it's this right here. Yeah, but you can, hold on, I'll go look. You're gonna go look. Yeah. It looks like a mountain range. No. This is what she's looking at. Up there at the top. It looks like a mountain range. Right? Right. There. Right there. I'm hoping the wind okay. didn't shred that flap. No, it's all wrinkled. Though. It's all wrinkled. Yeah. Okay. There she is. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> there. And back. Skeddy sandwich for lunch. That kind of does sound good. No Ventures in the heartland. Howdy, howdy. Guys, I will shut the door. Enough. Jasper's having a really, really super good day. I he wanted to go that. play with Jock. Oh, I forgot to mention that. Yeah, he took off running towards Jock to go play with Jock. And was like, no, 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 no. Nope, that dog's a little younger than you. <laughs> That's uh, slow baby steps, Jasper. Slow baby steps. <laughs> Let's not overdo it today, buddy. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. Hey, right, there you go, Gone Green Mommy. You can ask Jan or John about the fish in the Elkhart River. If anybody would know the fish things, they would. Fish. Yeah. Something about alligator gar in the Elkhart River. Mm -hmm. Hey, James L. Catanese. Howdy, howdy. Yep, Ford Man is, is a host. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. But, yeah, going green mom was asking something about an alligator gar. I don't know. That's what them are, I think. Yeah, but are they in the Elkhart River? There's, uh, they're in Indiana. There you go. Roy knows that much. Them things will try and right bite. Right there, Ventures in the Heartland. Yeah, them things will try and bite you. Uh, I've never messed with them because I don't ever remember them being in Indiana when I was a kid. I don't ever remember anybody catching them or hearing about them, but as yeah, an adult, down, I have. They do yeah, firmly not under the table, but... He says, I'm going to leave right here. And he's going <laughs> to make an earthquake. Yeah, he 
kid's uncle has seen them. Yeah, them things are... Mm. There's like the gar over there in Lake Tuakini. Them things got... Burrito for lunch, fish, and Brussels sprouts for dinner. That sounds good. That does sound good. I am craving some fish. Yuck. Oh, hold on. Um, I am... Might what? be right back. Hold on. Why? All right, I'll be right back. Oh, yeah, you got to move the air conditioner, don't you? Yeah. So he puts the mouse over people's... Gracie! <laughs> she sings. Yeah, Gracie's getting ready to go into town. I think. No, that's... Uh, the fish in the, that's in the Mississippi River, John. That highly invasive fish. What is that? It's a Chinese carp, ain't it? Yeah, we just call them gar. But they're, oh, they're creepy looking. Nope, nope, nope. So, but yeah. I know they, they're saying if Chicago doesn't close that one, how are they reverse the river? It get into Lake Michigan and start killing off the the fish population there. So yeah. Hey SV Kathy. Yeah. So I mean I think that lady was on the Mississippi River in a boat when that one jumped out and killed her. Oh, man, I gotta watch Bobby window. It's covered in spots. Yeah. <laughs> Stay, Jasper. Yeah. So, but yeah, it's, uh, I can't remember when that happened, but they were on, on the river when that fish jumped out. It killed her, because I guess as hard as it hit her, I'm like, dang. Now I'm wishing you would have put a few panels up. What? That breeze is chilly. I get that in a minute, then. But yeah. Well, all I know is we remember watching um we watched a documentary on it on how Chicago, you know, why they reversed the river, because that was where their sewage was going. And whatever they did to push the fresh water to help move the river, the fish can get into Lake Michigan that way if they didn't do something. And they were trying to get him to close it or something. That is the Asian carp. Asian carp. That's what it's called. Asian carp. Chinese carp. Good Lord. See, he knows what I'm talking about. Me too, because I got a funny feeling you get near it, you're getting electrified. Water amplifies that. So, yeah, that's kind of, you know, kind of scary. Yep, Royce. <laughs> I'm laughing at, yeah. Yeah, but it's called the Asian carp. They're very, uh, they're very, uh, what do you call it? When they get in the, in the body of water, they're very destructive to the eco-life. So... I can't think of the other term to call them. Invasive. They're a very invasive species. Yeah. Invasive. Yep. I don't know what he's doing now. Man can't sit still. So, but yeah, they're very invasive. Uh, oh my gosh. I think the DNR there for a while was uh, paying people to kill them. They got so much per fish or something, but I don't know if they continue doing that or not. Oh, getting closer. Yep, almost 1.4. Yeah, 
Yeah, they'll be glowing next. But yeah, they're uh gosh, what was that on? I think the history channel. Yeah, no kidding. How else were they getting there? There. Yeah, now it's a big old mess with those boogers. They're taking up everything. So. Oh. What? See where Ranger went. I'm actually surprised he's going around. Yeah, well. He's slow down toward the end of the season. Yeah. Yeah, supposedly th that the Asian carp was supposed to be couldn't reproduce when they were brought for over for fish farms help with allergy. Yeah, I'm sorry. They came from somewhere, so they had to be bred somehow. Did you probably get some water? Yeah. 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 There goes Rose. Bye-bye, Rose. Bye bye. <laughs> All right. You got it? I do. Yeah. So, yeah. Ah, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Traveling on Adventures is going after us today. I forgot. Oh. You didn't remind me. That is right. Oh, did I'm um um is there a link pinned in this live stream? I don't remember. Nettie just put it there. Let me look, but I thought I might have pinned her link. Hold on. I don't know if you did or not. Is there a link pinned in this live stream? We're on uh StreamYard, we can't tell. I'm going to go to YouTube and check, but if it opens. As soon as I find them. Oh, well, there's the scheduled there, right one. There. Upcoming, let's copy it just in case. Copy, copy, copy. And Eddie already dropped it. Why did I post it earlier? Nope, I thought I posted one or pinned one. There will be. Yeah. Here real soon. Use <laughs> the channel. Over here. Hit the mute button real fast. As soon as it pops up. It ain't muting. Mute. Okay. Drop this link. Wait a minute. I just pinned one of theirs. Do, 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 do. I thought you said there was a link in here. Right there. Mm -hmm. Pin. <laughs> what? Give me a hard time. Pin. Okay. We pinned Nettie's link up there. That's what I forgot to do then yesterday. Because I I did a bunch of things yesterday. No, you didn't. You slept. Apparently forgot to do that. I watch did a races. Lot. And watch races. I watched races. I scheduled a lot. Oh, wait. Friday. I'm thinking Friday. I you scheduled did. a live and everything Friday. Well, he's blind. <laughs> okay. Well, it's pinned got, now. Look, you got your sunglasses oh. on? Ah. I'm having a very sore shoulder right now. Right, because you laid on it funny. I don't know why. You and your dog, they're all snuggled. Yeah, he is that. I thought he had his... Falling asleep. Yeah. <laughs> He's enjoying the sun, though, today. Hi, Bob, Bob. Yeah. You enjoying the sunshine? Yep. Rose is leaving the queue. Yep. She's heading down to Yuma right now to say goodbye to Ivan. And um, then she's on her way to uh, Missouri. I mean, how to cook. The Asian carp in your oven to make it taste real good to eat them. They're really not around us to catch yet. There will be. Because I'm sure they'll be up there sometime. Well, they can get it up there in the Mississippi River and go up the Illinois and Missouri River. They got to get through the Kankakee River and then in our area. Well, them boogers can I jump. I to watch races, but I had to go. I watched uh, Sydney at Ice Surgery. Can see. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Jay James, you're in trouble now. She could see. Um... I watched the no. Craftsman Truck Race Saturday. Well, Saturday night, I, 
I was watching it in the daytime, but Gracie showed up, so we visited with her, um, which was no big deal because replays are better. I don't mind getting company during the races because, in reality, I don't have to watch commercials when I go back and watch them. <laughs> There's a helicopter coming right there. Yep. And uh. And usually there, there's a YouTube channel that gets them up right away. So I watch them later. That's a big old hill cover. Yeah, but glad Cindy don't need glasses now by teasing James. He's in trouble now. What? As you can see without her glasses, he's no. in trouble. No. See, what's nice is if Roy ain't got his glasses on, I can make faces at him from a distance. And I he can't, can't see crap. See? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, mm -hmm. friends are more important than TV. You can always catch a replay. Oh, yeah. Now, there was a time. <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't do nothing. I didn't move out in front of that TV for nothing. The house could be burning down, but I'm still watching my race. <laughs> Kids were fighting. He'd be sitting there watching the race. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. They, and they knew this. And, and Becky, she'd call up when we, well, before we had kids, she'd call up when we were dating. She lived an hour away. I said, hey, are you coming down to mom and dad's day? Nope, race is on. <laughs> I'm watching the race. <laughs> but now YouTube, they usually get them right up. Yeah, a few hours is... after the race now. No commercials, which is nice. 29, 30 years ago, yeah. There wasn't hardly any replays to catch. I mean, yeah, we had a VHS, but you still had to forward through the commercials. <laughs> and sometimes... It's a bad thing about VHS recording back in the day. You're thinking you're recording your show, and then when you go back to watch it, you got some stupid soap opera instead or something because you recorded a stupid channel. Who Corey, is Corey? Was my little Corey cousin. is. Put the camera on. Okay, hold on here. Corey is this little girl on the back of my. Oh, that's. Was my little cousin that died of uh, bone cancer. She would have been 18 years old this year. Yep. Yeah, she, she uh, died Sorry. 10 years ago. Yeah. Um, we had a big, huge benefit for... Hey, she Devil Adventures. My... Yeah, that was my little cousin's yeah, daughter. She died at the age of 10 years old. Uh, let's see. Very, very, very special girl. The whole community back in Stark County rallied around her. and There was her autumn. She wears a shirt. With Autumn's name on it. Not uh, my Autumn. Our Autumn. Um, they were the same age. It's same a black month. shirt. Sometimes I wear it too. Because we have two. We have yeah. two of each. You'll see me. We have. There was three kids that had cancer at the same time. Four. Yeah. They Four. Um, oh my gosh. I cannot remember the other girl's name. But she passed away. Hers wasn't cancer. It was heart problems. And oh, the parents well, couldn't she afford it. Well, regardless of what it was. We lost four... Three kids in the community within like... No, two. Vance survived. Yes. And you'll see me wear an orange shirt and it has footprints on it. Walk with Vance and it's got some Bible verse on the back of He's it. He's in remission. He's in remission. Um, but he had it at the same time Corey did. Uh, Corey passed away. Autumn passed away. And that other girl passed away. Yeah, but hers was heart complications. Um... So, yeah, it was a rough time for kids there for, in Stark County. We lost three in the bit. community, and Vance is still in remission. Hi, Greg and Shelly. Love back at you. They're rubbing it in. Greg uh, made his famous tacos. Oh, man. So, I, <laughs> I followed that man around just for his cooking. But Corey was a very <laughs> sweet little girl. I mean, well, even Autumn. Autumn smiled up were. to the end. Uh, Christina, oh, we forgot about our girl. Christina is the one that, from our school area that passed away. Yeah, it was Christina. Yeah, from cancer. But the other little girl, hers was due to her heart. Her heart just kept getting weaker and weaker, and she died. Yeah, we the, for some reason there for a little while we went on a spell where the the, the kids or we had a lot of kids so in our county that had cancer. In our little county, in like within like six months, we lost four kids. Mm -hmm. Thank Christ you, Timmy. Christina was, uh, hers was fight like a girl. Remember? Son, he could. I'm telling you. <laughs> Thank you, Timmy. But Christina was Autumn's friend from OD. 
He needs that, his own restaurant. That one, that one hit hard because I knew her mom. Remember, Amy? Yeah. That one was hard because she was the Girl Scout leader. But the other autumn, which is weird because her mom and me went to school together. We graduated together. We were all down in Riley's hospital with our autumns. They're same age, born the same month. And our autumn got the news that it wasn't leukemia. But her autumn had a rare form of leukemia. Mm -hmm. But she wasn't supposed to make it to 18, and she did at least. Yeah. He, they need to turn their fifth wheel into a food trailer. <laughs> so, but yeah, you know, so it was hard. Because two of the girls, Corey was my little cousin. That one was a personal hit. I've watched Christina and Autumn since the Girl Scouts together. Yeah. And my girlfriend Cindy and her daughter. Both our Autumns got along together perfectly. You know, it was hard watching that. <laughs> they might later. <laughs> later, Lee. You have a great day, Lee. <laughs> so that was that was hard that within six months. Boom, boom, boom. Mm -hmm. I mean, so, but we did a fundraiser for Corey. We did Autumns. We helped out in the other little girls. I can't remember her name. Wasn't her name Christina, too? I believe so. Yeah, we had two Christinas. We, we we went into that one. We wasn't part of the fundraiser, but we went there and, and did what we could. And we, we did what we could at the funeral home, too. We mm -hmm. left a little money. Kids go, my kids about 10 years ago and I had leukemia. So odd, so many kids. I know, it, yeah. especially at that time there. It that, that was... Um, even Oregon Davis even went through a spell before that when yeah. they had a bunch of kids that had, yep. that had gotten cancer. Yep. So, but yeah, it was, it was rough. I think Vance, we donated a big basket for a raffle that we threw together. So, I mean, we, some, we tried. Uh, we went we around did the and best got, we... collected other donations for yeah. the raffle because some of our friends, like like Andrea, she I know she contributed to Corey, and I think she sent us something up for Vance's, too, but I don't remember. Yeah, Holly. Holly, yeah. Holly, Holly did too. both. Shout out Martin and Sue said goodbye. Everybody, laundry's done. Helping Sue. Hello, the Corolla. Yeah. So, but yeah, it was a rough year. I mean, we got you going. Were we doing a little laundry today or not? I'm gonna try to get some done. Mm. We don't want you running around without no britches. Well, it is getting a little warm. No, you're not going britches, 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 britches list. There britches list, yeah. Yeah. britches list, britches list. That's a tongue twister. <laughs> britches list. I'm going so, britches list. But yeah, it, you know, but we have Vance's shirt. We got Corey's and we got Autumn's. My fight like a girl shirt from Christina, Autumn's friend. I think I gave it Oh, you're not getting <laughs> No, no, no. He's getting up, going to get some. Nope. nope. He just moved over. Yeah. He's very active today. Very active today. Very lippy, too. Very oh. has been for the last two, uh, yeah, since you last, last night. night. <laughs> we, we figured out a new nickname for Lulu Bell instead of Lulu Bell, which is her full name. I call her Lippy Lou. Lippy Lou? Yes. Oh, my I call God. you Lippy Becky. No, don't rhyme. I don't care. <laughs> but, yeah. So. Oh, we watched uh, we watched a movie this weekend. You know, should we tell them what we watched? Ghostbusters, Frozen Empire. It's a good movie if you're into Ghostbusters. We watched two of them, Internal Life. And then we watched Afterlife. We should have watched it first. I've never watched Afterlife. Actually, it kind of made sense watching the other one first and then the other one. Yeah. Um, well, I've never seen Afterlife for some reason. Um, but, yeah, Ghostbusters, Frozen Empire. We watched that last night. Oh, that was a good movie. Very, very, very good All movie. All right, Timmy, have a good day. They did uh Well, actually, with Afterlife, they did a really good job bringing... Igor, Igor, whatever his name was. I can't remember his name now. Pantless. <laughs> Dippy Becky. I saw the newest one almost fell asleep at the movie. <laughs> the first part was kind of blah, but towards the end it finally kicked It picked it. up. Yeah, it did. Yeah. Uh, they could have done a little more ghost hunting, I guess, at the beginning of it, too. I would have to say, yeah, because the first part was like... Where's now that? we're waiting on Kevin Costner's new series to come out. We're waiting on that. American Saga, Horizon, or Horizon, something. And American Saga. I'm getting her caught up on the Yellowstone 
series. We're, we only got a season and a half left of that to go, and then we got to wait on the new stuff to come out. Which not, and I got to finish my true my uh, detective. four minutes to the raid. You didn't. You closed it. Bart. I did. And we, I got to finish my detective show too that we've been watching. Yeah, we got only got a, like a season of that yep. left too. We're going over there. We got two minutes and fifty five seconds. Ron is not here. Ron is not here. He you had that ear so rules. close. I don't care. I don't watch need Ron. Good, that's it. Yeah, we got to watch a few good men. Uh, yeah, we got. Um, I did put that and saved it for watch later and forgot all about it. But yes, we are watching that because I watched the previews on that. Oh, and I I've it. never seen it and it looks good. I got to find another to see if we can find the other TV series. I didn't know it's been out for a while. Grim. They don't even sound good. You don't want to watch it, probably. It no. might, it might scare need, you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, Cindy's leaving today too, down out of the spot. Oh, I'm like, wait a minute, Cindy who? Cindy Lou. I forget her name, her last name. <laughs> and it looks like they are fixing the parking lot at Roadrunner. Somebody posted pictures of equipment. Oh, they got all the big craters yeah, in there? Yeah, so it won't look like Jeez. a bombed out crater now. We went to go in there. It, it's, be, the it's bad. It's bad because we uh, we started going to Coyote because the potholes at Roadrunner was so bad. <laughs> there wasn't no avoiding it. There was something in there that would swallow Bobby. <laughs> Grim's fairy tale or gory. Ah, Grim's fairy tale or gory. Yeah, as I said, he's going to have to... I might on. watch it then because I like Saw. Yeah, he likes Saw, but he won't watch the other movies. Yeah, I'm not. I don't like horror movies, but I like Saw. <laughs> You've been watching Supernatural with me too. That's not gory. No, <laughs> he thought it was. That's why he would never watch it with me. I don't. I'm not big horror. Go person. back up. I missed something in chat. Scroll up. What'd you miss? What'd you miss? Oh, that I forgot. You and I can't handle the truth. Oh. Hello, whoever's photo by me. That's Tim. That's Tim. <laughs> But yeah, because he always thought Supernatural was gory. One minute, Nutty said. Now, American Horror, the, that TV series, some of those can get pretty gory. And I there goes Tim. Oh, and Gracie. And Gracie? Gracie was in there with him. I had to dump the poo poo. Jasper knows it's Tim, too. Yeah. Poor guy, yesterday he couldn't understand why he couldn't go out to the clan, member. Oh, yeah. He's like, dude, it's too windy and cold. He oh, I was going to put a panel up for you. <coughs> All it's right. warming up quick yeah. now. Man, yeah, i got to open some windows. Let's go over here and see this. Well, they're waiting on travel on adventure. So when we see them, we'll go right there. But, no, actually, let's go right them out. All right. Yeah. All right, we're heading over to Raid Travel on Adventure. See you all over there. I know they will appreciate it. Uh, thank you guys for each and every one of you being here. Let's yep. go help them get their watch hours. Um, so the link is pinned, and they're dropping on the links here in chat. I got a news alert: cop chasing four wheeler at high rate of speed. Wow! I watched wow. one in Vegas the other night. It was a low speed chase, but um, yep, credits take a minute. So yep. All righty. So we'll uh, we'll see you over at Traveling Adventures. Till later. Then. Later, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.